What it do, homies? It's your boy, Dave, and I'm back today. We are here with another Angelina Jordan reaction. This time we're checking out the song uh, Born to Die. Now, I'm actually not too sure if I've heard this song before, uh, Born to Die. I'm not even sure who it is, who, who who sings it, you know, and I could just easily press escape and then go into the descriptions and find out in the comment section or whatnot. But I'd rather be surprised. I feel like it's one of those songs where as soon as I hear it, then I'm like, Oh, yeah, it's that one person. Anyways, let's go ahead, shut up, and turn it up and watch Angelina just lift the soul out of us. Let's go. Take me to the finish line Oh, my heart is raised every step that I take But I'm hoping that the gates They'll tell me that you're mine Okay, hold on. This, 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 is this a Lady Gaga song? It sounds like it. it this, this might be Lady Gaga. I think it might be. I'll find out later. Very interesting the way her voice is kind of chilling down there and how she just came with so much so much force right oh my goodness i don't even know how to explain that right it's just, that's kind of crazy i don't know maybe it's just a tone i just wasn't expecting that to come out like i feel like i've heard it a million times but it just it's, it's how clean it came out and i can feel that energy that she's just pushing out of her voice from trying to uh what's the word i'm looking for that that uh uh is the italian word to gravitas i believe that was was kind of give, gives it that sense of seriousness and sense of like meat you know what i mean i feel the the seriousness i feel the the gravitas in her voice okay okay I, i'm still not sure it sounds like a lady gaga song walking through the city streets is it by mistake of design? I feel so alone on the Friday nights. Can you make it feel like home if I tell that you're mine? It's like I told you, honey. Don't make me sad. Don't make me cry. Sometimes love is not enough and the road gets tough. I don't know why. Keep making me laugh Let's go get high The road is long We carry on We try to have fun in the meantime Come and take a walk on the wild side Let me hug you hard in the pouring rain You're like a girl's insane Choose your last words This is the last time Cause you and I, we were born to die. I'm telling you, I, okay, I gotta know who sings this song. I feel like, here, hold on, hold on. Born to die. Oh, Lana DeRay. Okay, okay. I do know a couple of her songs. I, I don't know why I got a Lady Gaga kind of feel from it. Maybe it's just because of the tone of Angelina's, uh, Angelina's voice. I was kind of getting Lady Gaga. I do know Lana DeRay. Yes, I've heard uh, a few, or not a lot of them, but a few of her songs. Oh, wait. One thing I'm learning, knowing about this song is this song looks like it's very, very difficult to sing, especially if you're not already kind of like a low kind of singer. You know what I mean? Because of how much time he spends down there low. And it's crazy because... Because we, you know, I, I know I've got a bunch of reactions to Angelina, you know, nowhere near like some other reactors do. Um, but it's like I learn a little bit more about Angelina the more <clears throat> the, the more songs that she sing. It's like um, it's like a profile of her voice kind of getting fleshed out right before me. And I'm starting to understand these type of things. This is like one of those songs where. Of course, it's lovely to hear her sing, but this is this, this seems like a, a growing song, if you will. You know what I mean? Like, like you know, when, you know, learning to sing is a journey, you know, no matter how good you are, you know, you're going to get better with enough practice, but eventually you want to start singing some of those challenging songs, the stuff that really puts your voice to the test and makes you learn something from it. And it's just something about the low part of this song and how she's singing this, what I think that this must've been a learning song for her, that if that makes, it makes a lot of sense. And I think she's doing it very, very well. Okay. Lost but now I'm found 
I can see, but once I was blind, I was so confused as a little child. Tried to take what I could get, scared that I couldn't find all the answers, honey. Don't make me sad, don't make me cry. Sometimes love is not enough and the road gets tough I don't know why you keep making me laugh Let's go get high The road is long, we carry on from In the meantime, come and take a walk on the wild side Let me hug you hard in the pouring pain You're like a girl's insane Choose your life Words. This is the last time Cause you and I We were born to die We were born to die We were born to die Come and take a walk on the wild side Let me hug your heart in the pouring rain Like a girl's insane Don't make me sad Don't make me cry Sometimes love is not enough And the road gets tough I don't know why Keep making me laugh Let's go get high The road is long We carry on the dry Have fun in the meantime Come and take a walk in the wild side You got it. Let me hug your heart in the pouring rain mm. You're like a girl's insane Choose your last words <laughs> This is the last time Cause you and I We were born to die We were born to die Is he gonna wave at us? Bye, no bye. Okay, no wave this time. Yeah, but absolutely amazing song. And honestly, I feel like I may have heard that song from Alana DeRay uh before, maybe on a radio, uh, but it's not that familiar to me. Obviously, I thought it was Lady Gaga ignorantly at the beginning for some reason. I mean, I don't know why, but either ways, you know, sometimes I can tell the amount of effort that customers, uh, not customers, <laughs> Angelina and singers uh put into like the, their effort because they because they're trying to like focus their their energy you know and to, to give a really really good performance right and even though this song wasn't sung with as much dynamics right it's kind of sung you know you can see in her hands just how much she's trying to focus everything into getting this that's that's why you know i was alone in thoughts of it possibly being like this is a challenging song for her and she did an excellent she did an amazing amazing job i wouldn't be surprised which is what you guys are telling me that you know sometimes she do rehearses maybe the day of or you know she just has a natural innate talent but there's definitely a song that i think helps help her grow as a singer um but <clears throat> um this might this this other aspect i'm thinking of might be more of a uh call to lana um uh, songwriting right uh because if you sing a song that low you know what i mean and and almost monotonous you know not necessarily the same notes but how lana kind of introduced some of those high notes and everything to kind of break away from that monotonous kind of sound that most of the song is in um i think that's a little difficult to do right because if you'd be singing that long for for that for that long that at that kind of like that low voice and then break into the high i feel like those type of parts right there you can get pitchy because then you got to go right back down, you know? So you either going to be, you either going to get pitchy going back down or you're going to get pitchy sliding back up. Either way, it sounded really, really good. Okay. And we know, you know, uh, Angelina was a little bit off, right? When it came to the, uh, came to, you know, the lyrics staying on time, but you can kind of see when she opened up her eyes, she's looking over to the left. Of course, she's starting to read the lyrics. And again, that's more than most people can do. You know, I can't even remember the lyrics to some of my favorite songs. So I guess they're not really my favorite. <laughs> and Angelina's here putting on full performances, not even knowing, just having a just having an idea. She might have a, a good idea of how the structure goes and everything, but you can kind of see when she's trying to throw in a little bit more of her flair, a little bit of herself when she's singing it, you know, kind of making the cover her own. I think when she 
makes these decisions. And then that's when moving on to the next chorus, like we kind of heard her stumble a little bit. I think she might have just been feeling the song, you know, and sometimes you just got to let the song take you, you know, mistake, mistakes and all. I enjoyed it even with the little, little rush part right before the chorus happened. But it was either way, you know, I got diarrhea of the mouth right now. <laughs> I always got a bunch of stuff to say about Angelita. Uh, but now it's you guys' turn. I want to let you I want you guys to let me know which I thought about this down in the comments. That's the end of this video. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and subscribe. Dave's out.